Tiger once again finding themselves in an advantageous position, but it's not a fantastic position just yet. They still have work to do. The Bat Chats now from EL Gaming once again on the move. Karen Tiger really have to respond well to this push. And they have to find the, the trade win here. Guan Ren already taking a lot of damage. He needs to go down here before he gets many more shots off. But in the end, he's going to actually survive and long enough to get the majority of his shots off. And Dekamori Sane in that 113, he's really committed to getting that kill. Didn't manage to get it. Someone else did, though. And, well, not sure about this one for Karen Tiger. They've got that player disadvantage now. And the HP disadvantage as well. Not looking too good. EL Gaming just picking the correct fight. Hellcury, though, in his E100 on full HP. So he's a big tank, and Dodo Waiting has found himself in a bit of a sticky situation. He's managed to flip his tank over. So yeah, three. Oh, no. How's he managed to do that? Dodo Waiting, what are you doing? Oh, no. It's a three on two right now. And Dodo Waiting, with his tank flipped over, there is no way that he can, or he should be able to contribute oh, to Alex Dyke will come up huge here. He's actually going to be able to take down Hades. So now a one on three for Hellcure to negotiate. The AMX-50B, not the slowest of tanks either, has a pretty quick rotate, but I tell you what, that rotate is going to have to be pretty quick here because I like this from Twist. Only 28 seconds left on the clock. I mean, sure, there's plenty of guys from Meltdown over there to actually get a reset if need be, but once they do try to peek for that reset, they are going to get absolutely lit up by all of these tanks from Twist, and Meltdown aren't going to have enough tanks in that brawly situation to really brawl it out here. Only 10 seconds left, and it seems like uh, he's tracked. Meltdown are waiting he for Valiant. He doesn't have the repair kit. Exactly. They're trying to wait for Valiant to get this reset here, but it doesn't seem like he's going to be able to get it. He has been tracked twice in a row, and uh, easy as you like, Twist picking up the victory. <laughs> wow! <laughs> I love it. I love it there, Twist with a This nice. is the bit where we all spam not like this in Twitch chat. Yeah. <laughs> And now they've only got 28 seconds to work with here, and it's a fairly similar situation. They actually situation. need to send someone down now. Yeah, they do. This is exactly the, sim the situation that we saw coming out on uh, Ghost Town, and I really like this from B Gaming again. They've got that pressure on EL Gaming. This time they're going to need to convert it a little bit better. Only 10 seconds left. I feel T4 Who's might have gone a bit cat? too aggressive here. He's being absolutely decimated. They should get the reset. I think nice, unless he goes down. Oh my word. Now we might see something coming out here for EL Gaming. Only one second left to get this reset. I don't think they're going to do it. B Gaming, they might have just won it. They, they've won it. They've just won it. This is where I really, really hope that B Gaming don't just let the yes, exact same exactly. thing hope it happen to them. I really hope that yep. because Tacky's not anywhere to be seen. Tacky's got a long time to get get back on towards it, and B Gaming don't have an artillery to, to try and get these resets. At the moment, B Gaming have the fastest round, so even if this does go to the tiebreaker, well, we'll see what happens with this round. Tiltil Matil needs to get a reset. Please don't let this happen twice in a row. That would be absolutely insane. I might lose my brain. No. What is no. going on? They've just let it happen. No. They've just let it be There's insane. no way that happened. You can't tell me that's legitimate. How does this happen? 